My son, I don't have much time left. I have grown old and ill, and my time is almost at an end. Before I leave this earth, I must tell you the truth. The truth about the day my blindness struck. Before you were born, I lived life as an imperial moth priest. My job was simple. To read and decipher the Elder Scrolls for the Empire. Scrolls of unknown origin contain our world's past, present, and future. But reading them is a dangerous task even for a moth priest like myself. But I, with my gift, served the Empire with pride. One day, I met your mother. Before we knew it, her mother was carrying you in her womb. Soon after, I decided to leave the dangerous life as a moth priest behind to raise my family and live a normal life. Years later, after your mother had passed away, I received a letter from Emperor Titus Mead II himself, summoning me to the White Tower once again. I believe you were ten years old at the time. The Emperor required my skills to read one last Elder Scroll, one that prophesied the destruction of our world. Refusing the summoning of the Emperor was not an option. So I undertook one last dangerous assignment as a moth priest. When I read the scroll for the Emperor, amongst the chaos that the prophecy foretold, I saw you, my son, as the ray of hope within the darkness. And for a split second, I lost focus in my reading. The consequence was my loss of vision. When the Emperor asked me what I had seen, I lied, saying I saw nothing, that my reading is not what it once used to be. I lied because I was afraid if I had told them the truth of what I had seen, they would have taken you away in my selfishness. The world may have paid the price. I realize now that if Nern is to survive, I can no longer hide you from your destiny. Dark times are coming, my son. And the Elder Scrolls foretell that you are the key to stop the destruction that lies ahead. After I am gone, you must promise me you will travel to our homeland, Skyrim. There is where your destiny lies. Promise me, my son. Promise me that you will go to Skyrim. I, I promise, father. But once I get to Skyrim, then what? I, I just don't know what to do. You will learn the role that you are to play in due time. As your father... This is my last request. I love you, my son. You took care of me for 15 years of 
blindness. And you were so strong after your mother passed. I wish I could have given you a better life. Don't say that, father. I lived a good life. All because of you. I am so proud of you. Goodbye, my son. For now, I will see you in Sovngarde. Rest in peace, Father. should have acted. They're already here. The Elder Scrolls told of their return. So, this is home. Skyrim. And no guards on the border. Brought my documents for nothing. Hmm. Where you're going? Over here. going on here.
Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here call you a hero. But a hero doesn't use a power like the voice to murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war, plunged Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. the border, right? Walk right into that Imperial ambush. Same as us. And that thief over there. Damn you Stormcloaks. Skyrim was fine until you came along. Empire was nice and lazy. But they hadn't been looking for you. Could have stolen that horse and been halfway to Hammerfell. You there. You and me. We shouldn't be here. It's the Stormcloaks the Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in vines now, thief. Shut up back there. What's wrong with him, huh? Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true High King. Ulfric? Jarl of Windhelm? You're the leader of the rebellion. But if they captured you... Oh, gods. Where are they taking us? I don't know where we're going. But Sovereign Guard awaits. No, this can't be happening. This isn't happening. Hey, what village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts should be of home. Rorikstead. I'm... I'm from Rorikstead. General Talia, sir. The headsman is waiting. Good. Let's get this over with. Sure. Mara, Dabella, Kinneret, Akatosh, Divines, please help me. Look at him. General Talia's the military governor. And it looks like the Dalmor are with them. Damn elves. I bet they had something to do with this. This is Helgen. I used to be sweet on a girl from here. Wonder if Vilod is still making that mead with juniper berries mixed in. Funny. When I was a boy, Imperial walls and towers used to make me feel so safe. I need to go inside. Why? I want to watch the soldiers. Inside the house. Now. Whoa. Yes, Papa. Why are we stopping? Why do you think? End of the line. Let's go. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting for us. No, wait! We're not rebels! Face your death with some courage, thief. You've got to tell them! We weren't with you! This is a mistake! Step towards the block when we call your name. One at a time! <sighs> Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak, Yarl of Windhelm. Been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Bailoff of Riverwood. No care of Rorikstad. No, I'm not a rebel. You can't do this. Halt! You're not gonna kill me. Archers! Be 
feel like running? Wait. You there. Step forward. Who are you? Look, I just happen to be at the wrong place at the wrong time. I mean no harm to anyone. You have to believe me. Captain, what should we do? He's not on the list. Forget the list. He goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. At least you'll die here, in your homeland. Follow the Captain, prisoner. Carry on. Yes, General Tullius. Give them their last rites. As we commend your souls to Aetherius, blessings of the Eight Divines upon you, for you are the salt and earth of Nern, our beloved- For the love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over with. As you wish. Come on! I haven't got all morning! My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials. Can you say the same? As fearless in death as he was in life. Next, the Nord and the Rags. What was that? I said, next prisoner. To the block, prisoner. Nice and easy. What is that thing? Could the legends be true? Legends don't burn down villages. We need to move now! Up through the tower! Let's go! and keep going. Go! We'll follow when we can.
coming! Get over here! Just walk towards me! Come on! Get off the road, boy! Get up, Papa! Get up! I'm done for, little cub. Go. Run for it! Hammond! You need to get over here! Now! Dada boy, you're doing great! That's it. Make me proud. Still alive, prisoner? Keep close to me if you want to stay that way. Gunnar, take care of the boy. I have to find General Tolias and join the defense. God's guide you, Hadar. Stay close to the wall! <laughs> Escaping, Hadlar. You're not stopping us this time. Fine. I hope that Randy takes you all to Sovereign Guard. You, come on! Into the keep! Close. Looks like we're the only ones who made it. We'll meet again in Solemngard, brother. That creature that tried to kill us. What was that? That thing was a dragon. No doubt. Just like the children's stories and the legends. The harbingers of the end times. We better get moving. Gunyar isn't coming back from the dead. Take his armor and anything else on him. Get that armor on, and give that axe a few swings. Alright. Now what? I'm going to see if I can find some way out of here. This one's locked. Let's see about that gate. Damn. No way to open this from our side. It's the Imperials. They cover. Get this gate open. Here. Here we are. Found the key. That's it. Come on. Let's get out of here before the dragon brings the whole tower down on our heads. doesn't give up easy. Trolls blood. It's 
a torture room. Going back that way now. We better push on. The rest of them will have to find another way out. Looks like the way out. I knew we'd make it. There he goes. Looks like he's gone for good this time. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. We better clear out of here. My sister, Gerder, runs the mill in Riverwood, just up the road. I'm sure she'd help you out. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. <laughs> Nor I without yours, friend. This looks... nice. After what we've been through, this looks too peaceful to be true. It looks like nobody here knows what happened yet. Come on. Gerder! Brother, Mara's mercy, it's good to see you. But is it safe for you to be here? Gerder... We heard that Ulfric had been captured. Gerder, I'm fine. At least now I am. Are you hurt? What's happened? And who is this? One of your comrades? Not a comrade yet, but a friend. I owe him my life, in fact. Is there somewhere we can talk? There's no telling when the news from Helgen will reach the Imperials. Helgen? Has something happened? You're right. Follow me. Pod, come here a minute. I need your help with something. What is it, woman? Spend drunk on the job again? Pod, just come here. Raylo, what are you doing here? Ha! I'll be right down. Now, Raylof, what's going on? You two look pretty well done in. <sighs> I can't remember when I last slept. <sighs> Where to start? Well, the news you heard about Ulfric was true. The Imperials ambushed us outside Darkwater Crossing. Like they knew exactly where we'd be. That was... Uh, two days ago now. While I was crossing the border into Skyrim, I happened to be there by chance. We stopped in Helgen this morning, and I thought it was all over. Had us lined up to the headsman's block and ready to start chopping. The cowards! They wouldn't dare give Ulfric a fair trial. Treason for fighting for your own people. 
All of Skyrim would have seen the truth then. But then, out of nowhere, a dragon attacked. You don't mean a real, live... He tells the truth. The dragon was black as night. I looked at it right in the eye on the chopping block. I can hardly believe it myself. And I was there. As strange as it sounds, we'd be dead if not for that dragon. In the confusion, we managed to slip away. Are we really the first to make it to Riverwood? Nobody else has come up the south road today, as far as I know. Good. Maybe we can lay up for a while. I hate to put your family in danger, Gerda, but... Nonsense. You and your friend are welcome to stay here as long as you need to. Let me worry about the Imperials. I cannot thank you enough. Any friend of Raylov's is a friend of mine. There is something you could do for me. For all of us here. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Of course. I'll rest tonight and go tomorrow first thing at sunrise. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. I need to speak to Jarl Balgraf urgently. I have information about the dragon attacks. Also, the people of Riverwood, they have sent me to ask the Jarl to spare some troops. Riverwood's in danger too? You better go on in. You'll find the Jarl in Dragon's Reach, at the top of the hill. Ah, thank you, friend. Pay whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my own.
What would you have me do then? Nothing? My lord, please. This is no time for rash action. I just think we need more information before we act. I just... Who's this then? What's the meaning of this interruption? Jarl Balgruf is not receiving visitors. Whoa, wait. I come with news from Helgen about the dragon attack. Also a woman named Gerder from Riverwood. She has sent me to ask the Jarl for troops. Well, that explains why the guards let you in. Come on then. The Jarl will want to speak to you personally. So, you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? Yes. The dragon destroyed Helgen. And last I saw it was heading this way. By Ismir, Irileth was right! What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls? Against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If the Jarl of Falkreath will mountains. view that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough! Not... I'll not stand idly by while the dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people! Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. You've done White Run a service, and I won't forget it. There is another thing you could do for me. Yes, my Jarl. Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. Faringar. I think I've found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Sounds simple enough. All right, what's the catch? Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Well, if you put it that way. I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone, said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. An old tomb, built by the ancient Nords. Perhaps dating back to the Dragon War itself. It's near Riverwood, a miserable little village a few miles south of here. I'm sure some of the locals can point you in the right direction once you get there.
Well, here goes nothing. Gods, what an oblivion happened here. These are treasure hunters. Hmm. Bow and arrows. These could prove to be useful. must open the gate. on to this just in case. Faringar did say this place was a tomb. But still, I was not expecting this many corpses.
many of them. Stay dead this time. Hmm. More of them. I'd rather not fight them again. I'll have to sneak by. Good to see some light again. Hmm. A lone guardian. This one should be easy to kill. Varangar, the Dragonstone should be around here somewhere. I hear voices. They are coming from up there. <sighs> what is this? It is written in some language that I've never seen before.
This must be the Dragonstone. Hard to believe I came all this way for a piece of rock. This thing better be worth it. You are one persistent bastard. Scroll doesn't kill it. I'm a dead man. Now, time to get the hell out of here. You see? The terminology is clearly First Era or even earlier. I'm convinced this is a copy of a much older text, perhaps dating to just after the Dragon War. If so, I could use this to cross-reference the names with other later texts. Good. I'm glad you're making progress. My employers are anxious to have some tangible answers. Oh, have no fear. The Jarl himself has finally taken an interest. So I'm now able to devote most of my time to this research. Time is running, Farngar, don't forget. This isn't some theoretical question. Dragons have come back. Yes, yes, don't worry. Although the chance to see a living dragon up close would be tremendously valuable. You have a visitor. Hmm? Bah, yes, the Jarl's protege. Back from Bleak Falls Barrow. <laughs> you didn't die, it seems. Well, that is what you need, right? Seems you are a cut above the usual brute the Jarl sends my way. So, what's next? That is where your job ends and mine begins. The work of the mind, sadly undervalued in Skyrim. My associate here will be pleased to see your handiwork. She discovered its location by means she has so far declined to share with me. So, your information was correct after all. And we have our friend here to thank for recovering it for us. You went into Bleak Falls Barrow and got that? Nice work. I'm glad I could help. Farangar! Farangar, you need to come at once. A dragon's been sighted nearby. You should come too. A dragon? 
How exciting. Where was it seen? What was it doing? I'd take this a bit more seriously if I were you. If the dragon decides to attack Whiterun, I don't know if we can stop it. So, Irileth tells me you came from the Western Watchtower? Yes, my lord. Tell him what you told me about the dragon. No, oh, that's right. We saw it coming from the south. It was fast. Faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the Watchtower? No, my lord. It was just circling overhead when I left. I never ran so fast in my life. I thought it would have come after me, for sure. Good work, son. We'll take it from here. Head down to the barracks for some food and rest. You've earned it. Irleth, you'd better gather some guardsmen and get down there. I've already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. I should come along. I would very much like to see this no. dragon. No. I can't afford to risk both of you. I need you here working on ways to defend the city against these dragons. As you command. One last thing, Irileth. This isn't a death or glory mission. I need to know what we're dealing with. Don't worry, my lord. I'm the very soul of caution. Good. There's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. I want you to go with Irileth and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen. So you have more experience with dragons than anyone else here? Yes, of course. I'm at your service. But I haven't forgotten the service you did for me in retrieving the Dragonstone for Faringar. Please, accept this gift from my personal armory. Monster, are you going to let me face this thing alone? But it's more than our honor at stake here. Think of it the first dragon seen in Skyrim since the last age. The glory of killing it is ours. Now, what do you say? Shall we go kill us a dragon? Yeah, damn yeah. right. Let's move up. <laughs> this woman, she is one hell of a soldier. So, House Carl, what do you make of this? No signs of any dragon right now, but it sure looks like he's been here. I know it looks bad, but we've got to figure out what happened. And if that dragon is still skulking around somewhere, spread out and look for survivors. We need to know what to do. Don't worry. We'll get you out of here. No, get back. It's still here somewhere. Rocky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. Guardsman, what happened here? Where's this dragon? Quickly now! I don't know. Oh no. I've heard that noise before. It's a dragon, all right. Here, let's save us. Here he comes again. Here he comes! Find cover and make every arrow count!
people dying out there. Is that all you want? Die, dragon! There are people counting on you! Come down here and fight! Coward! Get up! I'm a Nord, Skeever or Dragon. They're all the same to me. Think, think, think. The dragon is strongest in the air. If I can bring it down to the ground, it should be a lot easier to kill. I'll use the scrolls that Faringar gave me. How's Carl? Gods, stay here. I'll finish this dragon. Dragon Ball.